This video is a review for the brand new Divi 3.0 update from the Divi theme by Elegant Themes. If you don't already know what the Divi theme is, it is a beautiful page builder that allows you to create different types of websites with different fields, different branding with the exact same theme. This is a great theme to use whether you're a newbie or an experienced web designer all across the spectrum and it's a very, very brilliant theme created, like I said, from Elegant Themes. Now, before I go ahead and get started with this review, I do want to let you know if you want to get this theme, which is a theme I actually highly recommend for anyone to get. I do lots of tutorials on this specific theme and on Elegant Themes when it comes to creating and building your own websites, bootstrapping the work for yourself. This is the theme I tell just about anybody to use. If you want to get it, go ahead and head over to alimigadam.com forward slash get Divi. That link is right there below in the description below this video. Just so you know, this is an affiliate link. So if you do use it, I get a little bit of a commission off of it. It's how I support using these, creating these free tutorials for you. No worries if you don't want to use it. Not a big deal. I won't hate you. I won't even notice whether you use it or not. So if you decide not to, no biggie. It just helps, like I said, support these free tutorials that I'm creating for you. Now, let's get into the review of this new Divi 3.0. I'm very excited to show this to you. When I got into it and started checking out this demo, I, I can't even describe to you how excited I am about it and how powerful I can already tell this new update is going to be for anybody trying to build a website for their business or for their clients' businesses. So to let you go ahead and check out the demo, which you can do for free before even getting the Divi theme, you can check it out, see if you like it, get a feel for it. Go ahead and head over to elegantthemes.com and go to their blog page. You'll notice one of their latest blog posts, or if you're listening and watching this video later on, you can check out the blog posts by going to this URL right up here at the top. This link will be in the description below, so you can quickly and easily get to this blog post without having to type in that long URL right there. And scroll down just a little bit and you will find this great button that says try the demo free demo for free. You can give it a test drive, like I said, before even purchasing the theme. When you land on this page, you will notice a couple of things. First of all, you'll notice that there's not a lot of HTML. There's not a lot of coding. There is not a lot of things or, or how it would normally look on the back end of a website. That is what's so beautiful about Divi, especially Divi 3.0. You are viewing the page that you are building as if you are looking at it from the front end of your site. So you're looking at it exactly how your visitors would see this page. And what's so great about this, and I'm very excited to show you this, you get to edit it on the spot. So you'll notice as I scroll over these different sections of the page, all of these different editor tools popping up right here, you can edit everything on the page as you're viewing it, like I said, from the front end. You can already guess just how powerful this is going to be, right? And I'm able to create a different look and feel for every single website I built using this one single theme. And this new update that they came out with is so brilliant. I'm going to show you the power of this by showing you just how quickly I can add a great feature to this page right off the bat. So you've noticed I've already added a row to the page and now I'm in the module section. I'm going to add in a module right here and I'll show you how quickly I can add a timer to this page. very, very simple, right? I added a row, I added a module, I put in all the specs that I needed, all the details, and then I moved on. You'll notice in the demos you go to play with it, they've already added quite a few sections for you to be able to play around with and get a feel for, and they show you all of the different ways that you can be using all of these different features and modules that they already have built in to the site. Another great feature that I have, that they have, is that when you're editing and when you're creating different changes to your site, sometimes you'll notice you don't like how things look. You'll notice I made this red right here, and I actually did that on purpose. You'll notice it's kind of hard to read because of the background. It, it, it kind of contrasts a little weird, and sometimes for a lot of people that's hard to read. If you want to go back to edit, you just go to the edit history right here in the little clock down here in the bottom. 
and you can go back through. They save as you're editing the different changes that you're making. So you can go all the way back to the beginning and you'll notice all of my changes just disappear just like that. So you can go back and forth, redo and undo the different changes that you're making as you're making them. I can't tell you how many times I'll be working on a page for a website, for a client or for myself and all of a sudden the page will freeze or the internet will cut out and it'll make it so that all of the work I had just done is totally erased and they have to redo it such a time waster and Divi 3.0 automatically will save your changes as you're making them over time consistently so that you can make those changes back and over again or you can go over a different section or a module of the page if you don't like it super easy to get rid of you just push that delete button and it's gone easily add a new module by clicking the plus button and it's all right here for you you can make all of these different changes add in different areas of your site <clears throat> super easy and simple to use just like i mentioned before one other great feature that I love about this is that you can use all of their standard layer layouts that they already have. You'll notice I added in a blog module right here, but it doesn't look very good because of that background that I had. They do have different blog layouts right here that you can use for your own site. And then all you have to do is update the colors, the fonts, make it look like your own branding, and you've already got a blog page figured out. They also have contact pages, shop pages. You can see right off the bat the power of using this theme, especially with their brand new update for Divi 3.0. This is a beautiful shop page that I just created in seconds and then you can go ahead and customize it and make it look the way that you want to another great feature that i love about divi 3.0 is that this is in desktop view and i can view it in tablet view and in mobile view too and not only that i can still edit while it's in mobile view so that i know exactly how everything is going to look and feel on mobile and how it's going to be seen by my visitors so i know that everything is easy to read it looks nice and clean and cut and nothing is hanging over the site or they have to zoom in and out and it's very mobile responsive i'm in love with this theme if you can tell now another thing that i love about this is that as you're getting started like i said you can be a newbie or experienced and it's easy to use and it's easy to get the hang of but the problem is is when you're checking out the demo I do want to give you a little bit of a warning because when I went and clicked on the demo and I've been checking it out when I very first went to go see it I kind of got sucked in <laughs> I will be completely honest I got on the demo and I started playing around with this new features and trying to see how everything worked and I got so sucked in I didn't realize and I was already 45 minutes to an hour into it before I sat down and go whoa I've been on this for way too long that's how easy this is to use. I wanted to spend time on it. I wanted to hang out on it. I wanted to figure it out because it was a whole lot of fun to build pages and to play with all of the different settings that this new feature has. And I've only just begun to get into the different features that they have and all the different things that you could be adding to your pages and the power of using this new page builder. And I'm not going to go into every single feature here right now. I think that's going to be a whole separate video. And of course, if you have any questions about this or any questions for me, I've been a web designer for a while now and I'd be more than happy to help you leave a comment below. I answer every single comment that are left on any of my videos and don't forget to subscribe. So my thoughts and reviews on this, I give it two thumbs up. It's a really great update. Elegant themes, you are crushing it. I want to give you know kudos to you. You're doing a really great job creating these beautiful, beautiful pages and a beautiful theme for us to be able to use for our businesses and to create for our clients. So I definitely want to recommend this. If you don't already have Divi, I so recommend to go get it. Like I said, it's what I use for my own website, for my clients' websites, and I'm able to create lots of different looks and feels for every individual website while using the exact same theme, which is Divi especially with this new update that they just came out with. So if you want to get the Divi theme, go ahead and head over to alanmcadam.com forward slash get Divi. Again, that's an affiliate link just so you know, so I will get a commission off of it, but you don't have to use it and it's to no extra cost to you, of course. So go ahead and head over there, check it out, try and get this for yourself. 
recommend getting it for you, your business, your clients, recommend it for friends, whoever it is you feel like you need to use. Don't forget to go ahead and get it at that link. You can find it in the description below. Thank you so much for watching. I hope that this was helpful. If you have any questions for me, like I said, leave a comment. Check out the blog post that this will be linked up to in the description. And, you know, just keep killing it and enjoy using the demo for yourself. See ya.